At what point does a machine stop being just a tool and become a financial investment on the scale of a skyscraper? Today, we're counting down the titans of industry to find that answer. Most people will never see them, but they operate in a hidden world on a scale that defies imagination, carving out the raw materials for our modern lives. Each one is an engineering marvel designed to justify a colossal investment by unlocking even greater fortunes from the Earth. We're going to explore why these machines command fortunes, starting from the ground up and building to a climax that will redefine what you think is possible in engineering. Every great mining operation begins with a single, overwhelming act of force. Before you can dig, before you can haul, you must first tame the landscape itself. Our countdown starts with the undisputed champion of that act. This is the Komatsu D 575A-3SD Superdozer. Nicknamed the King of Dozers, its price tag sits between $1.5 and $2 million. So, why would a company pay the price of a Beverly Hills mansion for a bulldozer? Because you're not paying for a simple blade on tracks. You are paying for the pinnacle of brute force engineering. The cost is in its heart. A 1,150 horsepower engine that delivers relentless torque. It's in the blade itself, 24 feet wide and forged from high tensile steel, capable of withstanding decades of unimaginable abrasion. But most importantly, the cost is in the complex powertrain and undercarriage, engineered to transfer all that power to the ground without the machine simply tearing itself to pieces. On the mine site, this Titan is the great enabler. It performs the brutal, thankless task of clearing the overburden, the worthless top layer of rock and soil. It sculpts the very roads that even larger machines will travel on. In a single pass, it can move over 90 cubic yards of earth. Without this geological sculptor preparing the way, the entire multi-billion dollar operation would grind to a halt. It accomplishes the incredible task of shaping the landscape. But now, you're left with a newly created mountain of displaced rock. To move that mountain, you have to enter a whole new category of machine and a much higher price point. First, you call in the industry legend. This is the Caterpillar 797F the benchmark against which all other haul trucks are measured. For around $5 million, you are buying more than a machine. You're buying a reputation. The cost is an investment in legendary reliability. For decades, the 797 series has been the backbone of the world's biggest mines engineered to run 24-7 in the harshest conditions imaginable. Its 4,000 horsepower engine and battle-proven chassis are designed for one thing, maximum uptime. For many companies, this is the safest, most logical $5 million bet they can make. But what happens when you need to push beyond the proven limits? What if your operation demands the absolute maximum payload possible and you're willing to pay a premium for a world record? Then you acquire this, the Bellas 75710. At six to $7.5 million, this is currently the largest, highest payload capacity haul truck on earth. That extra $2 million buys you a completely different engineering philosophy.
Instead of one giant engine, it uses two, acting as generators for a sophisticated diesel-electric all-wheel drive system. This technology allows it to carry a mind-shattering 450 metric tons in a single trip. That's the equivalent of hauling 300 family cars at once. It is the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. But for all their power, these Titans don't work for themselves. They serve a single master, the true heart of this entire operation. A machine on a scale so vast, it makes even these multi-million dollar giants look like simple toys. Welcome to the throne room of the giants. The entry price to this exclusive club starts at $10 million. Our ascent begins with the pinnacle of European engineering, the Liebherr R9800. For 10 to $12 million, you're not just buying size, you're investing in speed and intelligence. Powered by two massive V16 engines, two hearts beating in sync, its value lies in its efficiency. In just three to four passes, its 45 cubic meter bucket can fill the largest haul trucks on Earth. In the high-stakes game of mining, that speed is profit. But to stay on top, you face relentless competition from the land of the rising sun. First, from the legendary house of Komatsu. At 12 to 15 million dollars, the PC-8000 isn't just a collection of parts. It's a perfectly integrated system. Komatsu is one of the few manufacturers that builds nearly every major component in-house. The engine, the hydraulics, the electronics. The result is a symphony of steel, where every part works in perfect harmony. This level of integration is what you pay for. A promise of balanced power and extreme reliability, engineered to deliver relentless metronomic cycles of digging, day in and day out. While Komatsu perfects its symphony of steel, another Japanese Titan offers a different path to dominance. For a similar price of 12 to 15 million dollars, Hitachi enters the ring with a different philosophy. If the Komatsu is a symphony, the Hitachi EX8000 is a rock concert. This machine is a legend in the industry, famous for one thing above all, its hydraulic system. It delivers some of the most brutal digging forces on the market, tearing through materials that would stall lesser machines. The investment here is in raw, unadulterated breakout force, a guarantee that no matter how tough the ground is, the Hitachi will not back down. It's a brawler, built to dominate the toughest jobs on the planet. But what happens when the biggest name in the industry decides to build the biggest, most powerful hydraulic shovel in its fleet? You get the undisputed king of this category. This is the Caterpillar 6090 FS, at approximately $15 million. This is the top of the food chain. In the world of mining, time is money and the 6090 FS is the ultimate cash machine. Fifteen million dollars. This is the absolute summit of diesel hydraulic power. These Titans are the undisputed champions of flexibility and speed, able to react and reposition as the face of the mine changes day by day. This poses a fundamental question. We have reached the peak of mobile power, so the next step isn't just to make it better, but to change the rules of the game entirely. What if your strategy is about permanent, overwhelming power? For that, 
you must ascend to the next level of power and price. You enter the domain of the electric rope shovels. And with this leap in technology comes a leap in investment, pushing well past the $20 million mark. We begin with a name that is legendary in the world of electric mining, the P and H 4100 XPC. At 20 to 25 million dollars, this machine is an institution. It represents over a century of engineering evolution, perfected for one mission, scooping up over 100 tons of earth in a single pass, with the relentless endurance that only direct electric power can provide. The investment here is in a proven legacy. These machines are designed to become a permanent fixture of the mine, working non-stop for decades. There's no refueling, no complex diesel engine maintenance, just a direct connection to the power grid, turning raw electricity into unimaginable profit. In this high-stakes arena, even legends face challengers. For a similar investment of 20 to 25 million dollars, Caterpillar brings its full technological might to the fight with the 7495 electric rope shovel. While also a master of brute force, the CAT 7495's value proposition is its intelligence. It's engineered to be a fully integrated part of the modern digital mind. Advanced onboard systems monitor every movement, optimize digging cycles, and communicate directly with the fleet of trucks, ensuring every ounce of its immense power is used with maximum efficiency. It's not just an electric giant, it's a smart giant. $25 million for a single point of excavation. These are the most powerful digging tools ever conceived by humanity. They are the absolute kings of loading trucks. But what if the goal isn't to load a truck? What if the goal is to move a mountain continuously without ever stopping? What happens when the cost of a machine is no longer measured by its digging power, but by its ability to function as a mobile, self-contained, geological-scale mining operation? You have now arrived at the final answer. $100 million. This is the Bagger 293, the heaviest land vehicle on Earth. That price buys you something that transcends the definition of a vehicle. It is a mobile factory. It doesn't dig in cycles. It harvests the earth in a continuous, terrifying flow, moving 240,000 cubic meters of material every day. The cost is not just for its 13,500 tons of German steel. It's for the audacity of its design the years of on-site construction, and the power to single-handedly feed entire power stations. It doesn't just work in a mine. It is the mine. From a $2 million dozer to the $100 million land eater, the price of these machines is more than just steel. It's a measure of human ambition, a testament to our relentless drive to build, to power, and to reshape our world. If your mind was blown by the scale of these titans, crush that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into the world's most extreme engineering. And let us know in the comments, which machine was your ultimate titan? Thanks for watching.